Oh, yeah. Hey, everyone. Today, I'm going to be showing you how to install Stable Diffusion so that you can create AI images on your computer. There are a few prerequisites that we need to make sure that we have installed, and I've copied all those links in the description below. To begin, we need to install Python 3.10.6, so head on over to that link and download the recommended Windows 64-bit version. Once that is downloaded, go ahead and run the file. Once open, just hit Install Now and Yes and allow it to do its thing. It'll say Setup Successful and then you can close. All right, the second prerequisite we need to download is Git. Again, I have copied a link below. Once you have this downloaded, you'll want to open it. The installer has a lot of prompts, but you can go ahead and just press Next through all of them. Once that's finished, uncheck Show Release Notes and hit Finish. Now that our prerequisites have finished installing, we can finally get to downloading Stable Diffusion. The link for this is under the description titled Automatic 1111. This download is a little different in that we are going to be using Command Prompt to download the application. To do this, open Windows Explorer and navigate to the folder you want to install Stable Diffusion. For me, I'm just going to head and choose the desktop. Right click and select Open in Terminal. You can paste the command there and press Enter. Once that's done, close the command prompt and head into the newly created Stable Diffusion Web UI folder. Scroll down, right click Web UI User.bat and hit Edit in Notepad. We'll want the path to our Python install, so to find this, click on Start and type Python. Right click the app and hit Open File Location. The first location is probably just a shortcut, so right click that file and click Open File Location again. Once you've found the exe, right click the file and hit copy as path. All right, head back into our notepad file and copy the path after set Python. Also add git pull before the call web UI dot bat line. Save and close and you are now ready to run the install. All right, for the final installation, I am gonna go ahead and clean up my desktop a little bit here. Once you are ready to go, go ahead and double click web UI user dot bat and wait for your computer to go through the installation process. My computer took about four to four and a half minutes to get through it all. Once it's finished, a new window should pop up from your web browser with stable diffusion. Go ahead and type out whatever it is you want the AI to generate and go for it. For instance, I could type out cat wearing a Santa hat. And after just a couple seconds, voila, cat wearing a Santa hat. Thank you, everyone. Don't forget to like and subscribe and write down in the comments what you would like to see in the next video. Peace.